all right man we're back episode 38 um quick recap last episode um so we did i want to say two new things one being the frog lights which we basically went to the nether and had frogs eat magma cubes and they turn into what are called magma or not magma lights but frog lights so we put a bunch of them like in random spots near our house it's not really like a designated spot yet um but we did get two new frogs this one does not have a name but then we do have cheetoed so that was one of the things we did last episode and then the other thing was we started on our nether warts farm thing Yo, jamal with the 140 bits appreciate that Lamarge is coming for cryptic because of the jamal incident for sure i appreciate that man um but yeah we started on the nether wart farm we don't necessarily need this um but it's good to at least have something but yeah that's basically the recap yo joshua with the two month prime appreciate that man that was in shot for joshua oh yeah so basically that's the recap we got some frogs made some frog lights and then started on our nether warts farm um with that said though i think in today's episode what we're going to be doing is finishing the farm for sure because it's not that much we need to do in it yo speed with the 45 streak w45 uh, and oscar with the seven string streak w7 man um, but yeah so we're gonna finish the farm which shouldn't take too much time and then we have a couple things that we still haven't done in the let's play series um one of them is the trading hall with like villagers we never bred a villager or got a villager to our house so maybe we could try doing that in today's episode um but the only other two things that i can personally think of besides that is the warden which we haven't done yet and going to the end but we're still i think these are nine in a row we're still 11 pearls away i am going to be sad once this series is over don't be sad we'll do we're gonna have another series with like a whole new thing and whatnot so um but i don't think i'm not gonna like end the world whenever the series is done We'll probably come back to it if there's ever any updates and stuff like that. Um, but with that being said, would y'all rather do the, well, I guess it's really just trying to get the, the villager, actually. Because the last two things are Enderman and Warden after we try and get a villager to the house. Did you do the trail trail ruins yet? I'm not sure what that is. Yo, Steve with the 35 string streak. But yeah, um, let's let's finish up our nether wart thing from last episode. I'm not exactly sure what we can do in there to make it look a little bit better. Uh, but we should definitely add something. So let's go down there and just see what could be added to make it look just a little bit better. Did you gel cue the iron golem yet? I'm not sure what gel cue means. Trial rooms just came out. You would enjoy it. What are the trial rooms? The Endermen aren't happy about Jamal. Yeah, the Endermen have smoke. So they're going to have to see us in the end about that one. Okay, so we definitely need the ceiling in here. And I don't know how big this is. I think it's an 8x8. Eight eight. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, so we have 64 blocks we need in here to at least put the ceiling. And then maybe I'm thinking we do like a little pillar in between or just something so it doesn't look as blocky. But yeah, um, we do need... We need more bricks because right now we only have 8. So let's go get some coal and some nether... I think they're called nether bricks or what is this called? the rack let's get two stacks of this and some coal and then go torch the coal so we can uh get the rest of the stuff that we need love your streams appreciate that Halia. how do you make a nether wart pick and stuff 
Um, you have to get it's called ancient debris, which you have to get them from the nether. And they're these like cinnamon roll looking things that you find in the ground, basically. I think we still have stuff cooking from last episode, so we might not actually even need to do anything here. We might just have to just wait for them to give the breaks. So while we're waiting, what what are the trial things? I don't know if y'all said it in chat. I didn't see it. Is that like a new thing or? Grab some of these bricks. Uh, let's split this in half so we can cook the other one. What's good, Maddie? We have Swift Sneak 3. We do. We do have Swift Sneak. Alright, there we go. We got a full stack. I think that's 16. No way. This dude targeted me from all the way over there. RIP. How do you find netherite? Um, you just have to go to you have to go to the nether and then just look around for the ancient debris. And then when you find those, I think you have to mix it with like gold or something like that. I'm pretty sure that's the general gist of it. All right, how much do we have here? We have 64. This should be 32. So we need at least, I think, four stacks of the nether bricks to have enough for the room. Give or take maybe like two extra stacks. That should be good. So we'll just wait for this stuff to cook. Let me split this. Yo, author with the 15 stream streak. W15, man. You have majestic lips. Thank you. Um, let's throw this in here with that. We can throw another one in here. Split this. Okay. Um, we have enough to do, I want to say half of the room in here. So let's go ahead and do that really quick. It would be nice if the, the furnaces and stuff would still work even when you're in the, um, like you're not near them. I feel like that would be helpful. Make a coal block because it smells 64. We did have coal blocks. I think we have some extra ones. I just didn't want to use all of them because I think we used about like five or six of them yesterday in uh, the last episode. Now, what do y'all think we should do for the lights in here? Do you guys think we should use the shroom lights or switch it up to something else? I don't think they're going to hang out the ceiling like this, um, but we need some type of light in here so it's not like super dark. Glowstone. I feel like glowstone could be cool just because this kind of is like the nether type look. Why don't you use lava instead of coal? Uh, we were doing it yesterday. I just don't think I have a bucket on me right now, but we definitely could have used lava here. Orange frog lights. I feel like the frog lights could work. The only thing is I think half of them are in the water. So we'd have to go find our frog lights. All right, we have almost a full stack. Um, let's see how much we got here. We got 12 more pieces. Let's go back, put those in, and then we'll get a bucket to get some lava. So we're gonna have to break this room lights that are in here so we can fix that spot. Let's go get a lava bucket really quick. So that way we don't have to use a bunch of coal. Have you packed up the ender dragon? We have. That's why we have the uh, shulker boxes and whatnot. Um, where's my bucket at? Hey Crip, how are you? How's the fam? TTS is not working for me tonight, so I'll highlight it. For sure. I'm doing good. How are you doing? 
what's this room for uh it's a farm so like these nether ward things we need these to make potions and to be honest we we haven't really ran out of them but it would just make sense to at least have something for it uh just in case we start to run out eventually all right let's get some lava probably should have grabbed maybe like two or three buckets so we can kind of go back and forth uh which one of these is not working i think they all got something in them right now and then i didn't see how many more blocks we needed for the room i'm gonna guess it's like maybe 10 or so um let's throw Oh, we did have a bucket in here. Nice. Let's throw a lava bucket in here and then go use the other lava bucket. A bigger nether wart farm? You think it needs to be bigger? How long have you been playing Minecraft? Um, this let's play has been 38 episodes, but in the total time span, I did speed running for about like, maybe like nine months or so. And then I used to play it when I was a little bit younger. Or considerably younger. But that was like two years ago. Alright, that's a full 16 stack, so I think we might have enough here. Boom. Let's see. We got 25. I think that's good enough. Hopefully. It doesn't have to be bigger, but bigger is nice. Fair enough. Yeah, I just don't, even if we do make it bigger, I feel like we don't need like a huge room because we're most likely never gonna be in here that often, which is the only reason why I'm like hesitant to make a bigger room for here. But we have the roof done now. Dang, so now basically you're saying I need to find me a new light skin mans to obsess over now that the let's play is ending? Crazy Mochi 08 sus. Not sure what you mean by that one. Um, so how can we make this room look a little bit better so it's not just flat? I feel like we could put maybe an arch in it somewhere. Or maybe we had like little arches around the back. Oops. Maybe we have like a, like an arch type thing here that just goes into the wall by one. Nether trees. PR mife. I don't know what a PR mife is, but nether fences and corner. That's a good idea. I like that. A quartz arch. Window cutouts with nether brick fence. Okay, let's see. Um, how much do we have? We have two nether brick fence, but we can make some more. I'm not exactly sure how you make the fence. Let me see. I need the actual brick itself. So let's make... Uh, we have eight right now. And then we could maybe try getting some walls. Do like eight of those and maybe some stairs and just see what we can do with that nether vines wait there's vines for the nether stuff okay let's see what the fence looks like in here okay it doesn't look bad i just can't really see it if i'm being honest it blends into the back leg completely Hmm. I think it does look you can see it just barely it definitely looks better than a flat corner though um the stair things what if we did like a arch here so it gives it kind of like a less box look and then like some type of make it similar to the bedroom similar to the bedroom how so? What if we do like an arch here? 
just so the room doesn't look as flat. And this probably won't lead anywhere, but like just for the uh, aesthetic, I guess, of less flatness. I feel like that looks a little bit better. Um, but what could we put? What could we put behind that so it's not stone? I definitely think that looks better in here. Put slabs next to the stairs. Oh, on this part. Magma. Ma I kind of like magma. Magma seems kind of cool. Lava behind glass. Obsidian. Okay, let's try the um, let's try the lava or try the magma first. If we have magma blocks. And see how that looks. I think we have a couple, maybe. I'm not exactly sure where they would be, though. Hey, right, we got 42. Nice. Alright, we'll try the magma. If the magma doesn't look good, then we'll try lava. And then we might try quartz as well. Join from TikTok. What's good, Juice? Let's see how this looks boom and then we have to put the actual stuff here the same brick stuff bam thoughts i think it definitely looks better than a flat wall 100 percent. i think it's okay um let's try let's try a lava wall and then we'll try a quartz wall and then we'll see which one looks the best and just decide from that so we'll do the same thing here what did i do one two i think it's a three by four when do we put this glowstone here and we're still gonna need we're gonna need another stair We'll do lava here so i think i gotta break the bottom part of this and then break the top part of this too and then i think we have two buckets in the in the nether decorate it with nether vines i don't know if we have any nether vines uh, but we could try looking at that as well let me grab some of this buckets I definitely think we had another bucket in here, unless it's already in my inventory, but I don't see it. Oh, there it is. And I think we need four, four lava Love buckets. The stream so entertaining helps me GTS at night. For sure. Do I enjoy the streams? Change out the gravel for stone. What gravel? What's good, big O? Use iron trap doors over the lava. That could be kind of cool. All right, uh, boom. Let's see how this looks. I don't know if it makes a difference if we use. Oh, we need another stair. Let me go get another stair. What kind of keyboard do you use? It is a HyperX something. I don't know the exact. What's good, Fred? I think that was Fred, right? Boom. Okay, between these two, which one do y'all like more? Magma or lava? I think they both honestly look decent. If I'm being honest, I think they both have their own style to them. The lava because it moves. Leave one and one. Well, then what would we do on this side? Because we still need, I feel like it makes sense to have it on all three sides here. 
unless we do magma in the front and then two lavas. I feel like that could work. Magma and lava in the corners behind the fence. Cords? Okay, let's try cords. I think cords, cords might look good. The only thing I'm a little whatever with is whether it's gonna throw the room off because the other ones are orange and this one will be full white. One magma, two lava. Yeah, I'm thinking, I'm thinking one magma, two lava. That's what I'm personally thinking. One, two, three. I think we need two more, two more stairs again. Put clear or red stained glass in front of magma slash lava. Mm, can we do that though with the stair right here? I don't think we can put like a small piece of glass in front of this though, right? I like the idea. I just don't know if we can keep the arch with that as well. Uh, let me go get another stair. Orange frog eggs. Orange frog eggs could work. We'd have to do another frog light. Ordeal. Okay, two more stairs. I'm honestly going to say off rip with the room. I don't think the quartz fits in here. But let's put the stairs on and just see. Yeah. Okay. So what do y'all think would be better? One magma and two lavas? Or one lava and two magmas? One magma, two lava. One mag, two lava. Two lavas. Okay. All right, we need to break this up here. Now we can fill this in. Boom. Now right, let's go get two lavas. I don't know how we still have lava in this area. How about we just magma the cube and call it square cry nerd? Magma the cube. Not sure what that phrase means. Never heard that one before. Okay. Boom. Bam. Thank you for reminding me to eat. Dig a square into the ceiling and do a ring of shroom lights. That could be kind of nice too. I don't know if we have enough shroom lights for that, but I feel like the ceiling does need something. Um, the only thing I'm concerned with going into the ceiling is that we're going to go into our chess room. Maybe not though. How many blocks is this? One, two, three, four, five, six. I think we have enough space. Okay. Do y'all think it should be a flat wall, like a flat ceiling, or go up like a layer in the middle? Like this. Go up a layer. Okay, and then maybe we can do the... I think the ring of shroom lights might look pretty good, actually. I like that idea. And then we have to break this. These ones and replace them. Can you jump on the nether wart stuff? Oh, you can. Personally, I think I like nether warts more than, than the normal soil for that reason. Are you designing the nether world? Uh, kinda. Kinda, it's just a nether world room, like a little farm for it. Okay, I think we'll do, 
a layer inside of this with the shroom light and see if that looks good. Which means we just need to do these four. And then we'll put the shroom lights in here. I don't know if we have enough shroom lights to do a full layer like this. Yeah, I think that's going to look good, actually. Let me see if we have shroom lights. I think we don't have any. Pretty sure they would have been in here if they were. They could be in the actual light side, maybe. Okay, we have three more. So I think we're gonna have to take another trip to the like fortress area. Okay, I think this does look pretty good though. It's got a little bit of light. It's got a cool design. Um trying to think if there's anything else we can do before we go get the last room lights in here something oh we need fences in these corners too and then hmm put fences in front of the archways oh like a like a window type thing stairs on the transition Oh, like from the top down, so it's not a block type thing. All right, let's make. Boom, there's the fences. Actually, we'll do a full thing of those. And then maybe we can do also. What is a chiseled nether brick? I've never seen that before. Let's try using these things too and see if we can do anything with those. Iron bars in front of the lava. We could do that. The only Upside thing Upside downstairs near the lights. That would look great too. You mean like this way? Oh, we didn't. I didn't get any stairs. I forgot to get stairs there. Which means we gotta go get some more of the nether brick stuff. All right, there's that. Someone said fences in front of this stuff. Let's just see what it looks like. I don't know if I'm feeling this, but let's just see. Mm, I think it looks better with it open personally. Unless we do like the bottom row, maybe. What y'all think? Fully open or bottom row? Low key? Low key with the bottom piece on it, it makes it feel like you're in like some type of tower. Like you're in like a nether tower or something. I actually think it looks kind of cool. Okay, we can lock that in. And then we still need the shroom lights. And y'all did say we could try stairs. I don't think there's anything I can use these for though. Um, unless we use these in the corner instead of the fences. Those are a little bit thicker though. Which y'all think looks better? The left fence or the right brick? The right brick. I definitely see majority right brick. Boom. Alright, we need three more of these things. We're gonna have to do one more nether trip for the rest of this stuff. Because we need stairs, shroom lights, and then a couple more of those. I think that's it in here. It looks pretty good for like a little farm. Oh, that's your house. I thought it was another. That's good. Thank you. W chat. I'll be having some fire ideas. 
right, let's grab all this. I think that's everything in there, which means we got 16 more bricks. And then we're going to go ahead and fly to wherever the, um, the shroom lights are. I didn't see how many shroom lights we need. I want to say if there's four blocks in the middle, how many is that around it? That would be four around the outsides. I think that's 10, right? To like go around it. Get nether vines. Do we need a, uh, do we need shears for that? 12. It's a uh, two in the middle. There's two in the middle. I think it's 10, right? And then we already had, I don't remember how many we had up there. We probably need just, I'm going to say 10 to be safe. It's 12. Okay. Well, we already had a couple up there, so let's just get 10. That should be good. This area is disgusting. I don't like it. Only for one reason. I think he fell in the lava. I don't see him. I don't think we can actually get rid of them while they're uh, in this area because I think they fall or something. Oh. All right, we got another pearl to add to our briefcase. Bam. We got 10 more to go. No proof. Oh, are these the vines? The twisting vines? I'm pretty sure we had the silk touches too, right? I don't think we can grab them normally. Um, let's use these blocks. They also have red vines. Yeah, I feel like the red vines, if we're going to do any type of vine, definitely the red ones would probably look better. Uh, sir? R.I.P. that pig. Oh, you don't need silk touch for these? Huh. I swear I thought y'all said we needed silk touch to get these before. Guess not. All right, we have we need we have four. We need six more. What are you gonna be doing um, next after the series ends? I think we're gonna have like a short period. Womp womp. I think we're gonna have a short period between hand of like doing random games for a little bit before we start the next series, because we got a good amount of suggested games in the Discord. Um, that have came out while I've been doing the series. So we'll probably do one of those and maybe like a bit-a-thon as well. Probably both at the same time, like random games, bit-a-thon, whatnot. And then uh, we'll do the modded Minecraft series. Supermarket Simulator. Yeah, I've seen someone suggested that. I need two more. Last one. Okay, boom. That should be good enough. Is there anything else from the nether that we might need for the room? We could get the red vines. I just don't know where a red vine area is. And I don't want to like... I don't want to get lost. Where do you go? two new pearls I mean we could fill this we could fill the briefcase up real quick if I'm being honest if you have VR you should do job simulator never heard of that one all 
All right, this is the last dude for now. We don't need to take all of them out. We just have to get our get back for a little bit for last episode. Where do you go? All right, that should be good. I think our house is this way. Our portal. I want to say it's this way. I think we're going the right way. Yep. I haven't been able to watch the last couple episodes because of my Wi-Fi. Can I get a house update and overall update? Um, last couple episodes have been mining, uh, or not mining the, what is it called? The beacon thing. So we got a bunch of iron for our beacon. We've updated our farm for our animals. And then right now we're finishing up making another wood farm. I think that's pretty much it as far as house goes. I think the rest of it is, oh, I forgot to get the rest of those nether bricks. Let's get those. What's the briefcase for? That is for um, the Enderman. So once this fills up, we're going to be taking a trip to the end and we're going to fight all the Endermen in the end. Because um, we lost a very good friend of ours in this episode due to the Enderman. Even though some people in the uh, chat who've been here for a while seem to think otherwise. It was definitely the Enderman. Make a skull around your portal and walk through the moth, the mouth thoughts. Oh, like make this into a skull. I think we'll probably keep it as is just cause it's been the same way since, um, since like the first 10 episodes. Do you remember when you killed your frog? See, I don't have to remind me that. R.I.P. Jamal, man. He was a dear friend to us. Alright, boom. This looks pretty good. I think the last thing we need is stairs going up to that. I think that's good on this room. What do we need for the stairs? I think it's the nether bricks. And the nether... Are these both called nether bricks? That's kind of confusing. Nether brick and nether bricks. Um, let's see, throw these in here. I don't know how many we'll need, so we'll just do 16. Hopefully that's enough. What's so important about the mushrooms? Uh, these, you have to do, like when you're making portals, you need these things to, not portals. I was looking at the portal. That's what made me say that. When you're making potions, you need these things. So we're just making like a little farm so we don't run out of them. Okay. Do y'all think we should do two layers of that? Like, should we do another staircase, an upside down staircase here? Or just do that top area. Finish the corner fence. Thank you for reminding me. Um, what do we need for that? Another one. Two staircases. What are we missing for the um the corner fence? Wasn't it three of them? I think it was three. and then all right maybe that's enough to do the first layer I feel like it might be fine with just one layer of stairs although two could look good as well there we go and okay I can barely see what I'm looking for up there boom Let's just see what it would look like. Okay, so yeah, definitely. I think it's better to just do one here because the arch and this pole thing, 
I think you're going to throw it off a little bit. Now, what about this right here? I'm just curious. Could we do stairs up here? I don't know how to make it turn. I don't know if that's possible or not. But it turns it there. Choosing to work a minimum wage job on a game will always be one of the saddest things I ever heard. Choosing to work a minimum wage job on a game. What, oh, the supermarket thing? Face them towards themselves. Oh, we could do a slab there. That's a good idea. Any simulators in general? I think some simulators are pretty fun, like the, the border patrol simulator thing. That one was pretty fun. Cause it's like a job that you normally wouldn't do. You know what I mean? Like most people aren't border patrol. All right, what y'all think? Should we have it as the normal bricks or have it as the slab? One for one for the full block, two for the slabs. Slab, slab, two, two, two. Yeah, I see majority twos for sure. Uh, yo, Chopstick, appreciate the rose and Madzy, appreciate the rose and the GG. Hey, just got here also, W hoodie. Where did you buy it? This hoodie, I think, was from like a TJ Maxx or something like a year and a half ago. I have no idea if I'm being honest, but I'm sure if you looked up blue champion hoodie, you might be able to find it. Okay, um, I think let's let's just finish putting another stair here, and I think this area is good. Someone did say the vines though. Let me just see what these look like. Now, if we were gonna do vines in here, it should definitely be the uh, the red ones for sure. But I don't think there's enough space to put these in here. If I'm being honest, how many more stairs do we need? I think it's two more so we need what is that two nether bricks and four nether brick i don't know that, that the whole nether brick thing is like super confusing with the amounts because the names okay uh we need some more we do have a ton at the house that we could just grab, but we might as well just mine these. That should be enough, I want to say. And we'll throw that in there. We could pull our frog in here. Yo, what's up with the, um, the gas things? Like, they got crazy range today or something? Just joined from TikTok. Love your lives. Appreciate that. Yo, Soulless. Appreciate the roses, man. Okay. This should be enough. I probably should have split it up, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. So that way I can do multiple at the same time. Let's do that. That should be a little bit, a little bit faster for the rest of these. We have... Four bricks. I think we I think we have everything actually. Maybe. Are you visiting the servers today? Uh I'm not sure. We visited them yesterday. The last episode after the episode was done. And we checked out a couple people's updates. But I don't know. If it I'll check it out if there's any updates. Oops. Oh, we didn't even need this stuff for the stairs. Now that I think about it, we just need the actual block. What are these things? Warped roots? Uh, 
I don't remember picking those up. You gotta check out Sarah's build. But if uh, if they're on, I'm down to check it out. I just don't like showing off people's builds if they're not there, because maybe they don't want to have it shown off if it's not done yet, whatnot. Okay. All right, what y'all think? W upgrade today on the nether wart farm. I, mean, I don't think we're ever going to change anything in here. But I think this definitely looks a lot better than what we left it as yesterday. For sure. All right, so we have two options. Um, there is one other thing we could do as well, but I think we'll probably just leave this for now. I think our farm's probably the only area that's not like done yet. It's like, I want to say it's like a third or halfway done. It could definitely look better than this, but it's a start. With that said though, would y'all rather try and get a villager to our house? or two of them and then make a, a villager trading hall thing, which I have no idea how to do. Make a barn with every animal. That would be awesome. That would be pretty cool. Hold on, did someone just knock? Sorry about that. That was my butler. I was trying to tell him that I can only fight crime in the middle of the night. It's a little bit too early. Um, but I didn't see what y'all said in chat. Was that, did y'all pick the villagers? I don't even know if I mentioned the second option. But yeah, should we do the villagers? Or should we go to the end? Poor Tracy, that was not Tracy. Cause we only need a couple more. We only need a couple more things in our briefcase and we could get those from the nether. Yo, Morgan with the prime sub. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Free ski sub. No kizzy. If y'all do have that blue crown, bro, you guys can sub up for free for free ski. All right. So I've seen like half and half. We might need to do a poll on this one. Um, one in the chat. Let's do it one more time. I'm gonna actively look at what y'all saying. One in the chat for the villager thing. Two for the end fighting all the the Endermen. TikTok is like eighty percent ones. Twitch is about fifty fifty, from what I'm seeing. Maybe sixty forty on the twos. TikTok is definitely ones though, for sure. Polls up on Twitch. If you guys are on Twitch, double tap the screen. It'll put the the chat up where you can actually vote on the poll. While you guys are doing that, let me clean my inventory a little bit because it is a little bit crazy right now. Um, we need a, another chest here, some more space. Let's see what I can actually put up. These can go in here. Villager is more interesting. I do agree because we're still not done with the briefcase regardless. So I do agree on that part. Shroom lights. Where was the shroom lights? I think they were in here. Boom. And then I don't have a spot for our vines and twisted stuff. Okay, so majority chat said one for sure. 
on both ends. TikTok was like 90% ones, and then Twitch was 70%. So we'll do that. I have no idea how to do that, but I mean, that's been like everything in this let's play so far. So we'll just take it step by step and figure it out. You should move all your nether blocks to chest in nether portal room. I think it would be nice to have some of these chests in the rooms that kind of coincide with them. The only issue with that is the chests in the room might make them look less aesthetically pleasing, you know? So that's only that's been the only reason we don't have like chests in our wizard room or etc. Okay, um, this can go in here. We got glowstone. And then our magma blocks. I think we're in here. And then we got a flint and these two things. I'm just gonna put those in there for now. That should be good. Flint. And then two of these warped nyliums. I did not know that's what these are called. Boom, bam. There we go. Okay. So to do this villager thing, what exactly do we need? I've never done this. Obviously, we're going to need a villager. I feel like, right? If we want to make a villager farm thing. Yo, TikTok chat. If you want to see base tours, progress and more, stop by Twitch and type Let's play in the chat for all the episodes on YouTube. Facts, WTTS. Yo, Bella with the subscription. W first time sub. W's in chat for Bella, I appreciate that. So we need two villagers, right? What is the best way to get villagers? Also, I think we're gonna need some more fireworks. So let's grab some paper really quick. Like how are we, how can we lead them to the house? Need boats? Boats. Okay. Oops, I think I just broke a glowstone or a glowberry. Okay, we gotta fix that really quick. Boat and a water bucket makes faster. Okay. Let's make these fireworks really quick. So we have some. Oh, we do have some. 64 and then 20. Boom. All right, we're stacked on fireworks, so we should be good for a while on those. All right, so we'll probably need, do we need a new village in order to get the villagers from? Cause we have three or four villages now, but they're not new ones. Yo, Olivia with the first time sub, I appreciate that. W's in chat for Olivia. Appreciate that. New one. What happened to the live on Twitch? We're live on Twitch. Find the closest one. Oh, we could bring our mending villager. Okay, I have an idea. This may be a little extra. I don't know. You guys tell me what you think, because this is just me being creative and trying to think of a solution. Our mending villager is all the way down there. What if. Could we make like a tunnel that goes all the way from there to here? Like in each of the areas that have land and we just walk him, we boat them down and then walk them through the little tunnels until we get to here. Or is that not the best way? I know we have another, we have another village somewhere over here. That's a lot, but yeah. I mean, how, how do we, how would we lead the villager over the land though? Like over the mountains? That's the only thing I'm confused about. I get, we can put them in a boat, but how do we like get them to walk over the grass?
Oh, a railroad. A roller coaster. Free chat by a boat. Yeah, we'd have to like push the boat. How do we push the boat up though? The nether would be easier. Okay, one in the chat for making a railroad. Not sure what we need for that. I have no idea, never done it. Or two for taking a villager into the nether and then traveling through that way. Okay, I just see majority ones for sure. Go to nether roof from village. It's all flat so it will be easy in a boat. Nether roof from village. Nether room. Oh, I see what you're saying. Like take them through through our nether room, through our portal room, all the way to the village. Put a lead on the boat and fly. Uh, this is, I'm gonna assume it's like the thing from yesterday. Yo, Morgan with the gift that I appreciate that Morgan. Toby's in chat for Morgan. Appreciate the gift. I'm assuming it's like the thing yesterday where y'all said I could put a lead on a frog and fly, and that did not work. I think that might be a bedrock only thing. Okay. So let's see what we need for rails. I'm pretty sure we just need a minecart and rails to do a railroad, right? Dig a tunnel in the nether way faster. Redstone on tracks for speed. A powered rail? Is that what we need? Oh, that's a lot of that's a lot of gold and stuff. Stick. We have redstone, so we're good on that. I don't know if we have a lot of gold though. That's the only thing. Is there like a normal rail? I thought there was a normal looking one, right? Put the villager in a boat and then put water down so you can go up the mountain. The water will flow down so you can go up. I'm not sure what you mean by that. Make a tunnel in the nether and steer the boat on land. You can um, find hella rails in mine shafts. That is true, and we do know where a mine shaft is. Appreciate that, K4. Okay. Um. I think both, it sounds mad complicated, I'm not gonna lie. Probably just cause we, I haven't done it personally. All the methods sound very complicated right now. I think we should make a portal at our mending village and then make a roller coaster in the nether that goes to our nether portal in the nether. Does that make sense or no? Instead of doing a roller coaster across the entire area up here, we do one in the nether. So then it's also, it's like faster traveling and the railroad. I think it does both, right? Just use a boat. Okay, I see some I see some people saying use a boat saying it's a lot easier to do that let me just see what y'all mean because I feel like the boat method just sounds very basic Bob ish you know I feel like the rails would be a little bit more exciting to set it all up and then push the villager down but let me just see what y'all mean Just make a farm close to one of the villages and go there as needed. We could do that too, instead of bringing the villagers to the house. We could do that. That is a good idea. Just teleport them. What do you mean, like with an with a actual obsidian teleporter? Okay, so we have a boat, right? Boom. We throw this guy in the boat. Can we throw two villagers in the boat? Because I don't see how this is supposed to work. 
I know the water will make it like move maybe. Oh, I have to be in there with, okay. Oh, I didn't know the boats worked on the land. Why are all of your YouTube thumbnails you with no shirt on Zesty? That was the first uh, thing from the first episode. Sounds like you more interested in a thumbnail than I am. So who really Zesty? Who? I'm kidding. Anyways, though, I didn't know you could. Uh, I didn't know you could move the boat. On the land. So I guess this works. I just feel like this is not as. I feel like this is very anticlimactic. Do y'all think we should do the railway to the house? Because I don't even know if we need the. We don't necessarily need the village or trading thing in the house. Using another to be faster. If you shovel the dirt, it makes it faster. Okay. Um, let's go get. We need obsidian. I think it's definitely gonna be faster than nether for sure. Get a lead on the boat. What do y'all mean by that? Because every time I've tried to put a lead on the boat, it has not put it like on the boat. Unless that's just a bedrock thing. Two villagers in a boat and then put a lead on it. All right, let me get a lead. Let's get a lead so we can try that. One lead. We need one bucket of water. Bam. Isaiah name the sheep after me on boys Mochio eight sus. I don't think a lead connects to boats. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I don't think it does. Make a villager breeder. It's mad easy. Shouldn't we make that at the house though if we want to make the, the trading center at the house? Instead of doing it over there and then having a boat everyone down? Oh, we need, um, we need eight obsidian. Matter of fact, I think there might be some obsidian. Let me see. Nope. Which means we need, let's go to a cave really quick and get the obsidian. I feel like that'll be faster than doing the buckets with the nether stuff. We should make sure we find our way out of here. You can use a lead. I'm like 95% sure it has not let us use a lead on the uh, on the boats. I think we've tried it like three times now. Let's grab these just in case we end up using them. Definitely a lot better to just grab these than to make a whole bunch. Because I don't even know what we make them with. Okay, lava is most likely a little bit further down. So let's go down here. See if we can find some type of lava pit. Iron and sticks. Got you. Okay, I did not know that. Isn't this the first cave you ever went in? It is. W memory. Okay, let's keep going down here. We're just looking for some type of lava pit. So that way we don't have to do the whole bucket method. I would assume this is gonna be faster, but maybe it would be faster to do the buckets. Let's see if there's any more of these. Still not over when you said, can we magma the cube? Y'all know what I meant, bro. Uh, we got some lava here. 
see if anything's I gotta remember how to get back. Is that an Enderman I hear down here? That's another one added to the chest. Put that in our briefcase real quick. We have seven more to go. All right, no lava pit here. Did we get a new bird yet? We have not. All right, let's go back this way. I don't want to get lost down here. I'm assuming there is a, a fire or lava pit somewhere. Sounds like there's one this way. But I don't have any torches to be able to look around. Eat, thank you. I want to say there is no lava pits in this area. We might have to go back up and just like dig down and find one. Or we could fly around at night looking for a lava pit that's like outside. Just bucket. Yeah, bucket's probably the fastest option, huh? Realistically. This is kind of just like random whether we'll find a lava pit or not. But let me look a little bit more. And if we don't see anything, we'll just uh we'll just go back. I see some light down here. Lava pit? Torch. I'm definitely gonna get lost down here, like for sure. I'm just trying to find anywhere that has some light sticking out, which I don't see any here. So let's just go back before I get lost. I think it was this way. Go to a broken portal and put water in it or on it to make your own lava pit. I don't think that lo I don't think that broken one has lava though. That's the only thing. Some of them have lava, and then I think some of them don't. Now, which way did we come from up here? There was another broken one nearby. Yeah, let's try that. And if we don't see a broken one, then we'll just go get the lava from buckets. Probably would have been faster to begin with, but then again, I feel like looking for it's a little bit more eventful than just using the buckets. Plus, since it's nighttime, we should be able to see a little bit better. If there is some lava somewhere. Um, let's go this way. You pass lava? It has to be a... Um, it's gotta be actual lava, like a pit of lava. Not like, um, not like this. It's gotta be like a whole floor thing of lava. Otherwise it doesn't turn into, why is this tree on fire? Huh? All right then. Here we go, this is what we were looking for. Alright, let's put our bucket down, get some obsidian. Bam. And hopefully none of these creepers come over. And didn't y'all say we could put like a a bucket down here so it doesn't oh. put a bucket of water next to it so just in case there's lava nearby it'll 
Make sure it doesn't burn or something. How does the firework and electric thing work? Um, basically the firework just pushes you up in the air, and then if you have an electric, it'll let you glide. It was Herobrine. Is that like a Minecraft thing? Like the if trees go on fire, then it's Herobrine. Because that is kind of odd that that thing was just on fire. Alright, we got 12. That's enough. Let's just grab... Let's grab 20 just to be sure. We don't have to look for lava again. Herobrine is no leaves. Are you sure about that? Please don't say that because there's a tree that has no leaves near it by our house that I know for a fact we never did. A hundred percent for a fact we never did that. Where do you get the armor trim? Uh, you have to find these little upgrade kit things. And then you find them in like random chests and whatnot. I'm being dead serious. How does he not know who Herobrine is? I know the general gist of Herobrine. I just don't know like what type of things. Like I don't know. I don't know the lore basically. But um, yeah. So based off of what you said, this tree is kind of concerning because I know for a fact. You could go back in all other 37 episodes of this let's play. I've never came to this tree and I've never done this for a fact. So maybe that was just lightning. I don't know. All right, let's go to sleep. We'll make the portal by our village and then we'll start moving to villagers. Yo, Lazar, appreciate the rose. Chopstick, appreciate the rose. And Ben, appreciate the 10 roses. Come. Okay. So, basically, what we're going to do is we're going to make a portal in the fire village. We'll push our villager through the portal and we'll walk them down to our house. And I think that's going to be the best bet on how we do this. You should light up your whole mountain. We should put some lights around it just so we don't have like the creeper issue again. Hey man, be watching for episode 22. Just want to say I love what you grow as a streamer. And I think my greatest accomplishment was getting the viewers you get in number. So man, just wanted to say thank for inspiring me to stream. For sure, man. Glad you enjoyed streams, bro. Shouldn't go, should have gotten emeralds to bait them. Oh, that is a good idea. I didn't think about that. Where did the um where'd the villager we had go? Was oh, that him down there? That is him. Okay. Alright, so let's make the portal. Who's in here? Isn't this a mending guy? Pretty sure this is a mending dude. It is. This is a good mending dude. So let's make the portal. I just don't want to accidentally get this dude cooked in the lava in the nether. Try the lead on the boat. TikTok chat. I'm going to tell you guys for a for 99% certainty, we have tried this. I want to say at least four to five times. I don't think it's going to work. But maybe all right. It does not work. But thank you nonetheless. Don't shift, shift. I, I did both. 
I shift, didn't shift, took the offhand thing out. It, it just doesn't work on uh, Java. Okay. Let's make the portal, see where it goes, and then pull the villagers into it. Just to see where we're going, let's go in first, so that way we kind of know. Okay, where are we? There's another portal down there. I've never seen that portal before. I genuinely don't recall ever making another portal into the nether, so I'm kind of confused on what that is. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, our home portal is like... I think it was like 45, 45 or something. So here's what we'll do. We're going to make a path for the villager before we start moving them in here. From the frogs. Oh, it is from the frogs. You're right, because that was where we put the frogs in. All right, I think we can drop. Can we fall down in a boat or will we take damage? I know in the, the speed running, you could fall down on a boat and you wouldn't take damage, but maybe it's different like in this version or something. I just don't want to fall and then get clapped from fall damage. We're just making our lives harder. Oh, W boots. They're good. Okay. All right. Hopefully we do not. Hopefully the villager doesn't get packed up. We're going to use the one that isn't like a mending dude yet or a lectern guy just to be safe. All right. We got to push this dude back. Actually, we can just, uh, wait, didn't y'all say we can move faster with this thing? If we do this on a, oh no, that doesn't make a difference. I think I'm kind of lost, but why don't you use rail, rail things in a cart to move the villager? That's what we were going to do. Um, it's kind of half and half. I think both methods work here. Realistically, I kind of want to make a railroad in the nether. I feel like that would be kind of cool. That goes to our other portal. I feel like that's the best option. Use a water bucket to push you forward, then recollect the water as you're getting on top of it. Oh, we left our water. Hold on. Let me see. Okay, I see that. Yeah, that makes us faster for sure. But how do we go? How do we go up? Or can we not do that? That's definitely a much faster way to go, though. Is it possible to go up? See if I can push him into that. There we go. Okay, we're just gonna have to do that until we get up to that level. Boat is more of a hassle in general. Railroad is faster and easier to navigate. I think we'll just do it in the nether. I think we'll do the railroad in there. Almost. No, this way. Wait, can I pick him up in the boat? Is that possible? Like, if I'm already in it and just, like, 
kind of drive by him in the boat, will that actually like grab him? All right, let's do it. Oh. Um. Okay, so slight problem. I think this is like the frogs where he has to walk in on his own, right? Which means we need an emerald. Otherwise, I don't think he's going to walk. And we need 19 paper for that. Trap him. Oh, that's a good idea. There we go. W chat. Mr. Villager, please do not walk into the lava, sir. Please. Here. Okay, so he shouldn't despawn, right? He should be good. Let's go, Rolly. Alright, so I think what we're going to do here is we're going to make a railroad that goes to our home portal, which I want to say is just straight this way. But I've never made a railroad. I don't know exactly how you do it. I think it just has to go down a block, right? Like stairs, basically. Something like that. Until we get to... A bottom area down here. It can be anything. It doesn't have to go down. Oh, well, it do doesn't need like. It doesn't need momentum. Also, I think it only needs to be one block, right? It doesn't need to. Oh, redstone powers it. Oh, okay, I see. All right, then we'll just do it from here then. I mean, at some point it's gonna have to go down though because we have to get it to our other portal. But we'll just break all this out, make a path. all this stuff in here just make like a tunnel that goes to the the first portal my guess is it's this way but i don't know for sure but we're just gonna dig through it i think we need to go like 100 blocks forward if you do use power rails um use normal rails because it won't work with power rails what do you mean We might have to make this turn here. I think we're going to be going through just strictly Blackstone, which is definitely going to make the mining process a little bit longer for this. Like when you turn, you have to use normal. Oh, okay. So power rails only go straight. And then if there's any turns, you have to use the normal ones. And just so I understand, you have to use a redstone torch to make them work? Or no? Alright, we're at 72. I think we're getting pretty close. We're gonna need mad iron. I think we have a good amount from when we made the, uh, what's it called? The beacon. I think we still have some leftover pieces. I don't know how high up our portal was. So I'm gonna start digging down here and hopefully we can find our other portal. It should be somewhere in the area. Go to the mine shaft. 
Yeah, we can just get extra rails from the mine shaft if we really need to. Worst case. Um, does anyone know how high up the portal was? Or our like normal portal that we go through? I wanna say it couldn't have been higher than 50. Or so. Here we go. Oh, here it is. Nice. Alright, so we need to make this go down. And then our portal's right there. Open this up a little bit. Alright, and we're just gonna wrap this down until it's low enough. And then have it stop by the portal. And that should be good, I think. I think this is pretty much the only thing I'm a little concerned with is the fact that it's like right by a bunch of lava. I don't know how to feel about that. But as long as the villager doesn't like hop out and just run into the lava, we should be okay. should be good to stop at um i kind of want to make like i guess this is fine what have you been doing and what else are you doing today um we have done we finished up the nether wart farm and then right now we're getting like making a villager trading thing but we have to make like a roller coaster is this good chat Will this work as a roller coaster or do we need anything else? I put, I did two lanes so that way we could put the torches on the side of it. I think that's good. And then the other side just has the rails. Box it in so you can't get out. Okay. Let's make a full little nether box thing. That should be tall enough. We gotta do one more layer. Okay, this should be good, I think. Hopefully. Um, do I need to box this off though? So you can't jump out. I think that's good. And then we can just break it to like push the boat. I think that works. Make a little staircase here. Box it in with the portal. The only reason I don't want to box the portal is because we go through this portal a lot and I just don't want it to look like boxed, you know? Alright. That should be good. I want to say this is good enough for a, like, makeshift roller coaster type thing. Boom. Um, an iron door, that's a good idea. That way you can't just like walk out, but he'll be in a boat anyway, so I think we're fine, right? So what all do we need for this? We need powered rails, or do you have to use the power rails the whole way through, or can you do like most rails and some powered? Like, does it matter? I recommend the box though, because it could fall off the side if you're not careful enough. Okay. Powered rails every once in a while. 
got you okay so like about every six give or take six seven or eight should be good all right let's do this two three four five six we'll do every seven one two three four five six wait did i do seven rails on the first one one two three four five six okay so basically six stacks and then a, the power things on the seven two three four five six one two three four five six one two three four five six four five six we might have to go get some more rails for the mine shaft one two three four five six one two I think we're gonna need like a whole another maybe like two more stacks of rails for this to work oh you don't need power rails if it's going down oh okay all right well regardless we still need we need more rails but let's go to our home portal and then i think we should have enough for that because it's just iron and sticks from what y'all said Just push it'll save time yeah it probably will i just feel like the roller coaster is kind of cool because i've never done anything with redstone or like rails before so it's like a learning experience okay uh, we need iron and sticks we have four blocks of iron, which I'm going to assume should be enough. Let me drop some of these other blocks too. Okay, need more headroom in the tunnel staircase. Oh, we need like three blocks for that area. Make the downhill a little higher so you're not hitting your head. Okay, got you. Um, sticks, we should have a ton. Do two stacks of those. Boom, we got 36 iron. Now, how much does a... We do need a mine cart. Let's make that. And then rail. We need... Oh, that's a lot of iron. But you get a lot of rails from it. That's not bad. Okay, let's get maybe two more stacks. And then the rest of it will be the iron, uh, the power. I think we'll probably only need like one or two stacks of power things. Okay, dog, appreciate the, uh, the heart. And Pepe, appreciate the rose. And Ben, appreciate the 10 roses. Okay. So how do we make the power ones? We need a rest on for that. Every 16. Do I have an iron farm? We do not. Wait, there's a clock in the game? What? I did not know that. All right, powered rail. We can only make six of these. I'm not sure why. Maybe we need more gold. Okay, 12. Hopefully that's enough. I don't know if it's going to be enough, but hopefully it is. And we'll do another stack. That should be good. Need more gold. Do every six. If we do it every 16, then uh, we should... 12 should be enough, I think. Oh, redstone torches. So how many do we need of those? We just need one by every, every rail. So 12. That should be good. 
And then we do have the minecart. Wait, we need two minecarts? Oh, I didn't even think about this. How do we get... We can just break the minecart to take it back, right? One for you and for the guy. Wait, you can't have two people in a minecart? No? What? So you telling me I can't like take a picture halfway going down the, the rails with the villager? What? Alright, we'll expand this one more so we don't hit our head. Okay, this should be enough space. And let's fill the rest of this in with the rails. We have like a hundred. I'm pretty sure that's enough for this entire area. How's your bracket doing? Bracket. One, two, three, four, five, six. Y'all said every 16 should work, right? I'm not sure what you mean by bracket, by the way. All right, so we'll start it here. Boom. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16. Perfect. And then we put a torch here. Bam. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Oops. Pickaxe breaks too quick sometimes, bro. It's a good problem. Bam. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Crip, show us the face you'd make on the nether coaster with the villager. The face I would make on the poster with the villager? Uh, I don't have one. I would just have a straight face. Wait, we do need it every six? Someone said 16. Whoever told you 16 is lying. It's every six. It would be too slow. <laughs> Y'all worry about the wrong thing, bro. Too slow is crazy. As long as it moves, it's fine. I think it's fine as long as it moves, bro. Cause we don't have like a ton of, we don't have a ton of gold and stuff to make every rail. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Just put one in between each of those. I don't know if we're gonna have enough though. That's the only thing. Two. Four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, three, six, nine. I'll let you rail 12. me, Daddy. Not sure what you mean by that. Fifteen, sixteen. Four, eight. I lost count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Oh, we don't need one right here, right? Because it's downhill. No. Okay. So then just like right here ish, boom. That's cool. 
and we'll just throw We'll throw another one here, just give it a little speed boost, why not? Boom. Is this big enough for the minecart to stop? Or does it need to be out a little bit further? OG song, I peeped the lyrics. It's fine? Okay, all right, let's just throw these last four in random spots, just to give it a little bit more oomph. We don't need it on the, the down part. It's okay, it might go back though. Yeah, how does that work? How do you make the, the thing go backwards? Like, can you send it backwards with a switch or something? They should make a roller coaster like this IRL. I would probably do that. Not gonna lie. I would definitely go on that ride. Bam. And then we can do one more here. That should be good. All right, y'all ready? Our first mine cart. Plop. Why do I just go forward? Okay, I see what y'all mean by every six. But it's moving though. Here comes the drop. Hey. Chris Ironk says nice. to put a powered rail at the beginning. Powered rail at the beginning so it has like a little speed. True, true. Putting a power rail with a with a button? But couldn't we just break this and then just walk back instead of pushing it all the way? Alright, we need we need one more minecart. Oh, if you push the button, it'll it'll like push you like an actual start instead of pushing yourself. Okay, I see. Alright, let's make one more minecart. Boom. And then that should be everything. Are we missing anything? I'll get one more power rail. Boom. Rest on torch. Yo, this inventory gotta get fixed, bro. There's too much stuff going on. A button. Don't have any powered on the slant so it won't take you back up so you'd have to take it back up manually oh you need powered on the slant ones too if it if it's to go backwards use stone for the button for show sure. okay um what else can we put up we can put up our sticks we can put up our flint and steel, we don't need that anymore. Our basalt, I don't know. I think this is the basalt. Maybe this one. Yep. And then our other gold ingots we can put up. I think that's everything besides the ingot and the sticks. Cool base, appreciate that. All right, that should be everything. Need more red torches for the power rails. Oh, I didn't think about that. I was just gonna, oh, and we forgot the button too. All right, let's do that really quick. We'll get five more torches and a button. And then we should have a fully working roller coaster in the nether. 
for our village thing. One, two, three, four. We need four sticks. And then a button. I think we just need a cobblestone, right? I don't know how you make a button. Is that not it? Maybe it's four. Oh, it has to be the actual stone stuff. Let's get two. So we can have two buttons. Where'd the, uh, oh. All right, two buttons, there we go. Can we see the sniffer? We'll check on the sniffer in a second. Trunks is up there chilling right now. Are your previous episodes, are, are they on Twitch? Oh uh, yeah, every episode is on Twitch um, or YouTube. If you type in exclamation point, let's play in the chat, it'll put a link to every episode. Where does the button need to go for it to work? Torches, thank you. Oh, it doesn't need a redstone if you just put it here. Oh. Why would you put a button at the bottom? Does it not make it go up? Yo, Ligma, appreciate the rose and follow. Appreciate the eight TikToks. Um, TikTok chat, the exclamation point let's play only works on, on Twitch. I forgot to mention that. Okay, let's put the other rails in here. And then I think y'all said we need to put them on here for it to go up. So let's put a couple on here. And we have to save one for the very end. How do I have two redstone torches, but only one rail? I thought I, I thought I had six and six. Maybe I'm tripping. Excuse me, sir. Did you pay for your apartment ticket or your not apartment, bro? <laughs> Amusement ticket. Well, the button. Oh, the button. I didn't mean apartment. I'm in amusement. <laughs> All right, throw this up here. And then we need a little thing for the button. A couple blocks. Then our button. Bam. Mine card there. Mine card here. Wait, well, the, the second one won't go, will it? Then we got to do it one by one. Put a block in front of it. Oh, it'll push it. What's good, Cryptic? How are you doing, boss man? Doing good. How are you doing? Appreciate your ass, guys. Uh, excuse me, sir. How do we... Uh, how do I get him in the minecart? I don't want to hit this pig. What is that down there? Okay. That's from last episode. Break the boat. Come here. In the boat. In the boat. There we go. Row the boat to the rail and then push him in a minecart. Put a block in front to stop it. Stop what? The this? Why would we want to stop the the roller coaster? Get in here. Get in the minecart. No. Okay. Um. Not good. Not good at all. It 
Sir, please get inside of your your boat or your minecart. One of the two. Can he not get in the minecart? Go. Go. I don't think it lets me put him in. Oh my gosh. No, don't do it. Just go this way. Sir? You're starting to freak me out. You have to close the other side of the rail. Yo, Ada with the gifted. Appreciate that, man. W gifted. W's in chat for Ada. Put your torch. What's the torch going to do? I'm pretty sure that's just going to make it... Push the minecart to him. That's why you need to block off the rail and it back so it doesn't move. Got you. Okay. Noted. Put a block behind the cart. No. Sir? Sir. The cart's off the rail. Oh, is that what it is? Oh, maybe he couldn't get on then, because it was like that. In the rail, sir. Nope, in the, in the cart. He's not uh, cooperating here. Sir, don't you wanna, yes, there we go. There we go. All right, he's gonna be taking a trip by himself because we don't have the other minecart. But yeah, enjoy your ride, sir. Yo, slime you with the 10 string streak, W10. So what's the point of the button if it doesn't automatically push him? I thought the button was there to like push it. There you go. Bye. Oh, he's up. How? Oh, the other minecart. Okay. Uh, no. No. Wait. <laughs> Yo, he's gonna fly off the other side, bro. Okay, let me go take, let me go take, get rid of this one. We'll get rid of this one, we'll push him down and he should be good. I think this should work now. Please put a block at the end of the rail or I'll cry. Like, please. There's a block. There is a block for sure. We have a block right here. All right, enjoy your flight, sir. Make sure he's got his apartment ticket. <clears throat> All right, what is this? we're just going to follow him. Why is my character like teabagging? Make sure he made it. Did he make it? Ta-da! We have a villager. Okay, so now the question is, we gotta get him in the house. We need an area that he cannot leave. That's the thing though, because if we put him in our house, what if he just walks out the house? That's the only thing I'm concerned on right now. I'm sorry, I, sir. Dude, I, this is why I don't like using the swords. Sir. Sir. The axe would never do that. It would only hit the minecart. 
Get in there. There you go. <laughs> have you traded with him yet? Uh, not this dude. We have another one that we can trade with though. All right, boom. Now push him in, in the boat. Sir, get in the boat. Sir, there you go. And then we'll move him here. And then he should teleport, right? What's up? Ta-da! Where did my boat just go? Villager? Get out the water! Get out the water! Get out the... W villager Bro I tried everything to help him bro I tried I think we messed our elevator up too I genuinely Oh my gosh So like, correct me if I'm wrong. You did not try, you blocked him in. That's cap. That's cap. I can tell you that's cap right now. Um, The reason why that's cap, do I have a block I can put down and get rid of this water? This is why that's cap. Look, does this still work? I think it's broken now. Yeah, it's broken. So we're gonna have to fix that. Bro told him to put a get out and put a block over his head. No, oh, y'all don't understand, bro. When the magma sucks you, it's not gonna do it now. When it sucks you down, you're stuck. There was no way out for him there. He could not, he, he's not like us. He can't just swim up. He doesn't do that. Especially when it's pulling him down, right? So what my thought process was, block the water and then bucket out the other water. Boom. That's the only way he was getting out of there. I don't know why it didn't work though. I actually have no idea why that didn't work. Um, and then this is another problem as well. How did this happen? That gave him no space to get out though. We had to prioritize. When you're in a you're in a tense situation like that, and you only have a couple seconds on the clock, the priority wasn't for him to get out of there, it was for him to not drown. And uh it just happened either way, honestly. So RIP to villager man. So we're in copper all right. Now, what is wrong with this? There we go. All right, so we need another villager. We're going to have to do a whole nother. Man. Okay, but can we take a second and just. Regardless of what happened to him, can anyone explain why that was literally Houdini? Correct me if I'm wrong, bro went into the portal and disappeared. Next thing I hear is uh, 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 in the water. Yo, Asan, appreciate the first time sub, man. That was in chat for Asan. Am I, am I, am I bugging right now? Or did he literally teleport and somehow end up right here? There's no way he had that much time. He had to full on sprint into the water. Maybe he panicked and ran around. Maybe. 
maybe yo follow appreciate the chilies and the heart puff okay well anyways we have a roller coaster that works um we need to figure out something for this though where they I, I think we had to block off our elevator i would have loved to see everyone else in that situation right i'm gonna keep it a stack 50 with y'all bro i tried i know it looked like i was endangering his life by putting a block above him but i really was trying to help him low-key anyways though let's go to the village and get another one Bro, block the lava in the wall If this villager runs into the lava, bro, at that point, they just don't want to. It, it's just intentional. Okay. So, can we minecart back up? Hey. Oh. Hey. Alright, well, we need more power rails. It's cool, we can fly. Not mending guy yet though, lol. Why why shouldn't we bring the mending guy? We're not gonna lose him, he's fine. He won't jump into the, uh, he won't jump into the lava pit that we have in our nether war room, right? Like, the villagers don't just be jumping over fences, right? He will? He's, there's no way he'll jump over a fence. I call a cap. No way. All right, time for you to get an upgrade, buddy. It is mending dude time. So either this is going to work or Make this Make sure is... he has his apartment ticket ready. Yep. All right, sir, right this way. What are you sleeping for? It's not nighttime. Follow me, sir. Right this way. Oh, no, I can't get in there. Is this a copyright song? It is, bro. Ah. Uh, Womp womp. I don't know how that got in here. Thank you guys for letting me know though. It's probably too late now, but thank you for letting me know. Okay, sir, can you follow me? Or maybe because it's nighttime, you don't want to move. Break the work table and use to guide him out. Get another one about a human being is crazy. Follow me. I have your your lectern. Right this way, sir. Yep, there you go. I doesn't want to do it. Come on. Boom. Alright, he's in. What? Grab that. Where you at? Sir? Sir. Sir, that's very dangerous, sir. Sir, you don't need to be... Sir. Sir. Okay. 
Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Like, what's up with these villagers today, bro? But they like on a mission to just run away, bro. What are you doing? Go that way, please. Not, it doesn't need to be like this. Just go to the boat. I will give you food, emeralds. Did you just lose the mending by breaking the table? No, he, they stay mending if we've used it before, I believe. Sir. Oh my gosh, there's a pig in here now. Boom. All right, one by one, brick by brick, we will get the villager into the minecart. I'm kind of concerned to break the boat here, so I'm going to move it over here just in case. Don't you do it. Don't, don't you do it. All right, we're good. Oh, the light don't work? Y'all sure? Oh, he moving. Let's go. He moving the right way. Let's see. Look, your lectern. Look at that. Will a lead work for villagers? It also, rip my boy, he wanted out. It will not work for the villagers for some reason. Right this way, sir. Yep, look. Look at that. <sighs> oh. Sir. I gotta push him in while he's going up to it. <sighs> Get in there. What? How's he not in it? Oh, oh, what? I want to go too. Woo! You can't put a lead on him because the creators were worried about people. Oh, fair enough. Yeah, that makes sense. All right. Okay, sir, I'm gonna need you to go to your lectern, which is right here. There you go. Ta-da. Look at him going straight for the water. This is a really scary horror movie. Okay, so we're going to leave him in here for now, and we're also going to, we're going to block this off just in case. I don't think he can hop out of here, but I don't want him. I need another block. I don't think we have another one. We're going to have to use our shulker for now. Okay, so we're going to leave him in here. Uh, we'll give him his bed for now. There you go, sir. You have a new house. How do you feel? Okay. Oh, the boat? Oh, we do need a boat so he doesn't despawn. There we go. Alright, so we need one more boat then. We can break this now. We need one more boat and then we have to do the same process, right? And that should be it. Put his lectern down. Imagine waking up in that prison. It's not a prison. It's a very sophisticated room that he just uh, will learn to love. Once he, he'll have a better room, trust. There, there's his lectern. And he still has mending for seven books, or seven emeralds. Okay. Is there anything else we need? We have our boat. Uh, let me see if I have an emerald. That might make this process a little easier. Yep, one emerald. 
Okay. Um, I think that should be it. Blocks for portal to make a room. The shulker went through the portal? It did. I didn't know that was possible. No, it didn't. I just looked at it. Unless it just popped up in my inventory. Am I tripping, bro? I know I be blind sometimes, but... How often do you stream? Uh, I would say on average about like six days a week. On average. Give or take. I don't know how we just flew through that whole thing, but... I'll take it. All right, we need one more villager. Next villager will go to water. You put a block and didn't break it. Okay, uh, remind me before we send him in to go get that block. Before we take him out the mine cart and send him to our house. Can we bring our map guy? Would that work? Come along with me, sir. Yeah, I have an emerald. Oh, oh, he's just bougie. He he rich. Bro, don't even want the emerald. Oh, I can just use his uh his table thing, right? Ow. The block is gone. There you go. Sir? Oh, we can get our other mending, dude. This one's terrible, though. But, I mean, why not? Might as well. W witch. If you know, you know. Alright. Come on. Follow me, sir. I have a nice, juicy emerald. Whole lot of nope this way. Huh? Y'all don't like free money? Okay, we're just gonna have to use the lectern. I guess they don't like emeralds. Where's he at? Boat? They sense their fate and are scared of you. Wow. That is just, uh... Interesting of them to sense something. I mean, I'm not doing nothing bad. We're just trying to get them some new a new house that isn't messed up. Right? Like, their house is pretty cooked over here. We have more food at our house. We got good lighting. Like, I feel like we're just helping them, you know? Here, sir, here's a boat. Nice. Okay, slight problem. We need one, though. We don't need two. One of you guys, please get in the boat. I mean, are like, why are, why are they holding hands? Boom. All right, we're good. We just got to swim up the water. Oh, uh, we can't go through this. Huh? Bruh. There we go. Johnny under the water block knows what you did. Sent a telegram from heaven. Huh? Eh? I think this water is too strong. I don't know how else we can get him up here. Can we just... Can we just lectern him up after they go to sleep? Sir? This is my sleeping area. 
And he closed the door on me. Look, a lectern. Look, a lectern. Wow, a lectern. Yo, do you see that over there? It's a lectern. What what happened? Oh, he fell. One more time. Where did you go? One or two more times. I just need you to follow me, sir. Yep, there you go. What is this cool looking book thing over here? Wait, it just, now it's over here. Ow, what just hit me? I don't even know what just hit me. Oh my gosh, there's a, a pig in the... All right, boom, a lectern. Ta-da, he's in. I actually don't know what's shooting me right now. All right, sir. Nope, not that way. We're not going to do this again. Nope. I've already met somebody just like you. Y'all will get along a lot from what it seems. Put blocks around the portal in the nether so the villagers don't wander when they go in. Yeah, we should put some something around because we already had one of those pigs come out. Question. If I was to hit one of the um, these pigs... If I hit one of those guys in the overworld, are they going to be mad at me in the nether? Or no? Yo, uh, period. I can't see your name, but appreciate the 50 roses and follow. I appreciate the heart me. No. Okay. I'm not going to test it just to be safe because I don't, I, I like being in the, sir. All right. You know what? What's that over there? It's a lector. In a... No. N I mean, how is this dude like evading the boat, the mine cart? I'm just confused on what's happening here, sir. You're standing on a boat. Would you be so kind as to go in the boat? What's wrong with him? What's this guy like the chosen villager? There we go. Alright, uh, we had another minecart. I don't know where it went though. I'm gonna say it's down here. Oh, let's just grab this one right here. Boom. I like your hair. Appreciate that, man. Put the boat in the minecart. Is that possible? No, nah, that doesn't work. Wow, look at that. Look, it's a minecart. Look. How is he not getting in it? Whoa. I'm so confused right now. He's literally holding it. Like he's keeping me from pushing it into him. Is he in? I really hope he, I don't think he's in. I actually can't tell. No, he's not. I almost sent the boat or sent the thing down. Activate the rails. I mean, this dude is just him, bro. He won't get in the boat. He definitely won't get in it. All right, I have an idea. I have an idea. Look, a lectern.
Don't you please, bro. We have to get rid of this thing before it hits the villager. No. You have to threaten him. We might have to. You might be right on that. Excuse me, sir. If you look to your left, there is a lectern. How do I know? I don't know. I just know. Stop. Okay. Now, how are you floating? What is this, Chris Angel? I'm so confused, man. Block the back. It's blocked. We got a block here. Oh, emerald. Yeah, maybe the emerald will work. Excuse me, Mr. Pig. Oh my. I can't be bothered with this dude. I actually can't be bothered. Like, what is that timing? The pig walks in front of him so he won't walk to me. And then the minecart just happens to go down as soon as he walks. Just ride the boat with him down. We did not make this whole railroad to push him with a boat. Sorry, it is not happening. Bro is going to have to go in the boat or in the minecart. He's he's walking on it. There we go. Go, go, go. Okay, I can't let him wander off. It won't work. It definitely works. We just did it a second ago. Is it me? Like, am, am I the issue here? Or is this villager just like... This dude's aware. Like, he knows he's in a simulation of Minecraft or something. Try throwing bread onto the minecart. The villager should walk and pick it up and might be able to go into the minecart. I don't have bread. Will he go after a... Will he go after an emerald? Look, an emerald. Yo, yo, yo. I can't, bro. I can't. And the boat's going now. <laughs> Give me one second, bro. Lot of crime in Gotham tonight. Okay, so we have an issue. Cryptic zero villages too. I don't want to leave the villager here because he's gonna he might run off somewhere. But we need the minecart. 
Does bro have a YouTube? Yeah, if you come to Twitch chat, because we're live on Twitch as well, and do exclamation point let's play, it'll put every episode in a, in the chat, like a link to the playlist. I really don't know what happened to the other minecart. Oh, there was two of them in the same thing. I see. Okay, we have like one solid chance to make this work, bro. Because he could have ran away by now. <laughs> Sir, look what I have. You know what? I have another idea. All right. Let's see if this works. Put this here in a lectern there. Now when he... Sir? You don't see this nice lectern over here? He's the chosen one, ha 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 ho. <laughs> this villager is actually like aware. He is, this one's conscious. Sir, I your mending thing is right here. Don't you like your lectern? What's wrong with him? He don't even go to the thing now. Use the emerald. He don't even want an emerald. No, this is not. No, there's there's just no way. Something's wrong with this one. A bed? Oh, you almost got me. I ain't gonna lie. Whoever said a bed in chat, you are foul. You almost had me there too. Please follow me, sir. Just kill him, he deserves it too. Come on, we ain't gotta do that. Sir, please. I just need you to go into the minecart, bro. And we don't have a... All right, we'll let him roam around for a second. We need another boat. That's the only way we're gonna be able to do this. He can sleep in another. I don't trust it. I feel like he's going to walk into it and blow up or I'm going to blow myself up one of the two. All right. Take 76. Eat. I don't think we have any food right now, actually, sadly. We're going to have to get some food when we get back. Excuse me, sir. Please don't walk into the fire probably wouldn't be good for your health oh maybe look a lectern you need to sleep I overworld we do need to sleep in overworld sir can you please just work with me on this just go in the boat, bro. He is jumping on the boat and jumping off of it. You need to sleep in the overworld so he'll do his task. Oh, is that what it is? We haven't slept? Yo, tie with the oh my gosh. Bro took the blue pill. Hi, 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 Appreciate the honey bits, man. Ha 
Alright, maybe that's what it is. Maybe we needed to sleep. Bedrock? This is Bedrock. Oh, there's another villager. Honestly, skip the mending, dude, bro. I think that's the cartographer. Right? It is. Alright, we're just gonna take the cartographer, bro. He's just... That dude is just different. I've never seen a villager, like... Just be aware like that. All right, work with me, buddy. Oh, just like that. And then we're gonna, no, no, yes. Yes, you are much better than that other dude over there. Where'd he go? All right, enjoy your uh, roller coaster trip. Where did the other guy go? I feel like bro got ate by a magma cube or something. The pigmen be whispering in their ears. We'll just let them stay here, bro. We don't need that mending book anyways, if I'm being honest. he's He costs 30 for mending. We're fine, bro. Don't forget to fix the water. Thank you. On the plus side, we have we should have two villagers now. You need him? Wait, do we need him? All right, how do we do this before? We put a boat here and then just boat into it, I think. Don't, don't start, bro, please. Sir. Oh my god. What am I playing right now? Yo, Pradon, Tiv, appreciate the hearts. I mean, where did this dude just go? Sir. I'm never doing this process again. These guys are just like too smart. Let me go back a little bit. Okay. I think, nope, his head is too big. We gotta go back just a little bit more. The water. You were supposed to fix the water before you let him out of the mine car. All right, we're good. Jake, or Fred, don't do it. Get down, Fred. Don't do it. I don't want... Yeah, thank you. Fred's been here since, like, episode two or three or something like that. Okay. Everybody's in it, bro. We have two villagers. We'll give them two beds. Boom. Actually, I think I need to boat this guy so he doesn't, like, disappear or something. I don't know how it works. Boom. All right. I think this is a good spot to go ahead and say. Yeah, let's just leave this for next episode, bro. So we got the stuff we need to make the villaging thing and breed them. Um, I think that's going to wrap up this episode, bro. It's a W episode, though. Uh, we got the roller coaster thing set up to move them. What was the first thing we did? Oh, we finished the nether room. Uh, the nether wart. Nether wart farm thing. The W episode, though.